This is African American History is American History. Hank M. Kearsley is an artist and educator who expresses his social vision through his art. He has lived through a time in America prior to the Civil Rights Movement and continues to witness a world struggling with racism and oppression. As a result, the social issues that Hank addresses in his paintings and drawings are based on his own personal experiences and a testament to his unwavering commitment to social justice and equality. Many of his paintings are figurative and historic, inspired by people and places he has known. Hank Kearsley's drawings start in sketchbooks, which then become vehicles for his paintings. Now, how do I know so much about Hank Kearsley? Well, not only is he an exceptional artist and educator, but Hank Kearsley is also my father. Hank Kearsley has simplified his paintings by using primary colors, red, green, yellow, and blue. He achieves variety through color contrast, rich painting surfaces, and layers of pure color. The intensity of spatial color relationships allows the viewer to see a much wider range of color. He blends aesthetic and formalistic painting with a strong social vision, striving to find truth and raise questions for his viewers. Hank Kearsley's Black West series of paintings was inspired by the stories of the many freed slaves who went west seeking greater opportunities. Despite encountering staggering racism, many individuals persevered to make their mark on history. So what made you decide to do a series on, on the Black West? I think I decided because I had been doing a number of paintings uh, dealing with social injustice and uh, slavery. And after doing some research uh, on slavery, I found that there were a number of, of slaves freed in 
and uh, unfreed slaves who went out west to uh, seek freedom and uh, many of them became cowboys and uh, not having known it, of this in schools and in, in the schools that I intended I thought maybe I could educate some students and young people and, and adults to the fact that, that how important blacks were to the settling of the West, not so much as, as the movies portrayed only the John Wayne uh, or Lone Ranger type of people. So uh, I decided to interpret these people in paintings, mainly trying to show their, their strength on canvas in, in terms of their abilities to be sheriffs and marshals and um, horse trainers, etc., I guess probably the most uh, common reaction is the fact, well, I never knew about these people. I never heard of them, you know. And uh, also, and that that's coming from both uh, p- people of color and Caucasian. They don't, uh, they never heard of it because it, it certainly wasn't taught in schools. Most of the paintings started out as, as you know, I got ideas. I did little sketches and pencils and say in my, my sketchbook, and then uh, put it on canvas and, and went to oils because, of, I mean, these are colorful characters and uh, I think that they deserve the, the color of, um, of the paints to depict, uh, you know, how prominent they were. The um, oils also led me to use, a, to use the paints heavy and depict um, the strength to it. Yeah, yeah depict yeah. strength and, and um, be able to um, change the color. Um, many, many, uh, of course, many of the uh, of these cowboys and people in the Black West were of mixed race, and uh, it was quite easy enough to change the colors to light or dark or. So, what's next? For this, I mean, where are you gonna? Well, I have to continue the the Black West series. Or? Yeah, I I I, I want to continue going with it. But um, I have, uh, and you mentioned before, Beckworth. I want to do painting of him. He was a trapper and guide, mm-hmm. you know, and very prominent. And then there's another outlaw, um, is our Dart. I guess not not very. Not a very good outlaw, apparently, and you know, all these two long guns and stuff yeah. like that. But I want to do one of him, and so there are there are a few other people, you know. That still, it's a you know, it's a vast concept of of people that that uh, made it out west, made those kind of contributions that that uh, we don't know about, you know. Yeah, and they certainly don't teach it in school. That's right. I mean, that's, that's right. Yeah. Well, I just want to thank you for sharing this with us, and uh, you know, also let everybody know that um, you can view these paintings. Uh, my father's uh, website that's www.hkartstudio.com. Uh, right. Yes. Yeah. And that's it. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> This is African American History is American History.